Welcome back guys, General Tony here, your host, and welcome back my friends to a brand new episode on the channel. Today, we need your help guys. Now, if you've been sub to the channel for at least a couple of days or a couple of weeks, you will know on the Captain Tony account guys, it is kind of like my new base. It was an extremely, really, really rushed base, and we've tried our best over the last, I would say, eight weeks since Christmas trying to save this base guys, and we've actually done so many upgrades inside of the base currently we are doing five upgrades guys so we're doing a great job but it is time to get serious guys so what we plan to do we plan to get to five thousand trophies guys however i need your help because i'm kind of stuck so we've been at three thousand two hundred trophies for the last couple of days and we need to try and create a new strategy to get even higher guys so what i want every single one of you my subscribers to do let me know down below in that comment section, out of all the troops and spells you can see on screen, guys, what new strategy should I use to get to maybe 4,000 trophies, guys? So what strategy would you suggest for me to use on the Captain Tony account to try and reach 4,000 trophies, guys? Now, what we're going to do, we don't actually have any armies cooked up, so I am going to create myself a brand new strategy right now. And we're going to see if we can get some trophies here in the episode, guys, as we try our hardest to get to 5,000, guys. But we're going to set a benchmark. We're going to see if we can reach 4,000 trophies by next Friday. So if you think we can do it, make sure you subscribe to the channel to join us on the journey. So let's go into the quick train. Let's remove the army down the bottom, guys, and let's come up with a new strategy. So basics are going to be rage spells. I'm going to go for a double freeze. I am going to bring a poison this time, and I am going to accompany that with a double haste, guys, because we are going to do a little bit of a weird combo now. We're going to try something many people don't do. We're going to do a super queen walk, and we're going to incorporate it with an air attack strategy, guys. So I'm going to go for four healers. We are going to up for four baby dragons. I'm going to go for five dragons, and let's fill some balloons up, guys. Actually, let's reduce the baby dragons to three. Bring two more balloons. And then the final two housing spaces are just going to be a couple of minions. Let's reduce one more baby dragon. And let's bring a couple of extra minions, guys. So this is going to be attack strategy number one. We are going to give this a go. We are going to see if it works. I'm only going to trade it once, guys. Because I want to see if the strategy actually works before we continuously use it, guys. So we are locked and loaded. Level 6 balloons, level 4 healers, level 2 dragons, level 2 baby dragons, and level 4 minions. We are currently upgrading this, the uh, the free spell to level 2, guys. So we're going to have a level 2 free spell. Once that's upgraded, I think we will be upgrading possibly balloons, guys. Possibly balloons. Oh, no, wait. My bad. They're already maxed out. Maybe dragons. Dragons could be a really good shout. So let's do this. Here goes. First time... Using this new quirky attack strategy. It is a combo, as I said. Ground attack using the uh, the Super Queen Walk. And, of course, incorporating it with an air attack strategy, guys. So stay tuned. We'll be back in a couple of moments' time. Let's find ourselves our first target. Okay, so here we go, guys. We've landed on a Town Hall level 10. Now, you can see there isn't any Archer Queen. There isn't any BK. And that is a fantastic indicator for me that we can get a nice two-star on this base, guys. Now, I'm not going to lie. It is quite a max level looking base. It does look pretty damn good. So we're going to give it our best shot. And we are going to see what happens, guys. Now, I think what I'm going to do is I am going to use the Super Queen walk over this side of the base to clear all these buildings out. And we'll make our way down towards the southwest of the base, guys, where we will use the rest of our actual troops to come in and clear the rest of the structure. So let's drop in a couple of minions down the bottom. Let's take a look at the queen. She is in a little bit of trouble already, guys. So we're going to drop a rage spell. Don't forget, she's only level 32. So she isn't the strongest. But um, we are hoping for two stars on every single one of these strategies, guys. So if this doesn't manage to grab a nice, easy two star, we will be forced to change the actual strategy. So the queen is still looking okay. But I've got a feeling she's going to need another Rage spell shortly, which I don't mind doing. I don't mind using two, but we certainly won't be using three, guys. So if two doesn't get the job done, then I'm afraid we're going to have to come up. Oh, damn, I accidentally dropped a Rage spell. That sucks. 
Okay, that sucks real bad, guys. But um, I'm going to use another one. Oh, no, we're not. We're going to use the Queen's Ability instead. Here we go. Queen's Ability is going to get used. She is successfully going to defend against the majority of those defenses, guys. And the Expo has got distracted onto the other defense. So, let's see what we're going to do here. What I'm going to do, I'm going to use the King to take out all these buildings down the bottom. And we are going to focus on this Queen still. Let's just see what's going to happen here. I am going to use the final Rage spell. Now, I did say I was only going to use two. But obviously, I dropped one by accident. So it's not too serious, guys. Here we go. Now all the defenses are down. I'm going to move in with the dragons. Drop in the balloons on the sides to try and avoid the air sweepers. And I am going to use the first haste spell, guys. And a freeze spell to, to, to uh, freeze that actual air defense there. We're going to go with the second freeze spell. Here we go. Hey spell is in. And I'm going to go with another hey spell. Try and get these balloons to go into the center. We have got the one star. But unfortunately, we haven't secured the second star just yet, guys. But there's still a little bit of time left inside of the raid. Let's see what the queen's going to do. So she's going to get stuck on the wall. Let's drop that poison spell down. Take out those air larries. They are going to get melted pretty quickly. There we go. And the last one survived somehow, guys. Queen's going to annihilate it. And let's move in with another baby dragon. Let's just take out this gold storage, guys. Get some extra loot before the raid ends. So, Queen has got a little bit of time to try and grab the second star. Unfortunately, I don't think she's going to be able to do it, guys. There's only several seconds left in the raid. You know what? She, she didn't manage to do it. But we're not going to give up just yet. We are not going to give up with this strategy, guys. We still got a one star. And I did mess up a little bit, guys. I accidentally dropped a rage spell. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to quick train up the exact same army. We're going to go straight in for a second live attack. If I mess it up this time, we will most definitely be changing up the strategy. So let's do this, guys. Here we go. Live attack number two. Let's find ourselves a second opponent. Fingers crossed we can find another town hall level 10, which doesn't look too scary, guys. So... Down all 11s, we're not really all about that just yet. We're not, we're not, I wouldn't say we are uh, at the equivalent level in terms of heroes and troops, guys. So let's see what we can find. Once again, stay tuned. Hopefully it's going to be something awesome. Yo, so here it is. We've landed on target number two. It actually took quite a long time to find this base, guys. And this one is going to be a challenge. Higher level defenses and it's got its heroes up and running, guys. And I'm going to give it a go. Because I really want to test this strategy to see if it works, guys. Or should we bin it after this attack? So what I want to do, let's locate the air sweepers. There's one. And there's number two, guys. Okay, this dude's completely wasted his air sweepers, which is amazing because I absolutely hate them. So what I'm going to do, we are going to come in with a baby dragon at the bottom. I'm going to use a baby dragon off to the east wing just to take out those structures, guys. That's going to stop the queen from going around the right-hand side. And we should be able to get in here and take out this air defense, guys. Now, as that is going on, let's prepare the rest of the attack. And what I'm going to do, I'm going to use one minion, two minions, just to filter those buildings, guys. And make sure we can get a nice little funnel going. There goes a poison spell on those defenders. Oh, damn. It's a P.E.K.K.A. It's a P.E.K.K.A., guys. We're in trouble. We need to make sure this P.E.K.K.A. doesn't slash my poor queen. Oh, damn. Oh, damn. Oh, damn. Yo, check it out, guys. We survived. We absolutely survived that. But we did waste not one, but both of the free spells. Now, I know we could have used the Queen's ability, but I would rather have used the free spells, guys, and save my poor little Queen. Let's just take out a couple more of these buildings and see where we're at, guys. So we're already at a one star. Sorry, we're already at 20%, not a one star. And the queen has done a sufficient job of clearing these structures on the right-hand side. She's about to take out the CC. And we're looking good. I, I think we're looking pretty good, guys. So where's she going to go after the clan castle? That is my girl. Just where I wanted her to go, around the outside still, guys. So as that is going on, I'm going to drop in the king. We're going to drop in all five dragons. And I'm going to follow up with the balloons on the back foot. I'm going to send in the minions. And I'm going to use one of the rage spells either side, guys. So two rage spells, nice and early. Let's follow up with the free spells. Sorry, the haste spells and the king's ability, guys. Here we go. What are we looking at doing? Are the balloons going to reach the Inferno Towers in time? Not quite, not quite. But we do have dragons trying to make their way into the center. 
Once again, I don't know if this is a two-star strategy, guys. Doesn't look like we're going to be able to grab ourselves a second star unless the queen's going to pull off something pretty drastic here. So, still got a baby dragon. And we've got 40 odd seconds in the raid. I'm going to chance this. I'm going to use a baby dragon to either clear out any air mines or air bombs or do some damage to the inferno tower and the town hall, guys. So, here we go. Baby dragon is snuck through into the center. We've still got the queen's ability. The Expos are going to get taken out. If the Queen goes for the Town Hall here, it looks like the second star is being grabbed, guys. Okay. Are we going to get it? Is the Queen going to go down? Yo, second star in the bag. And we're going to grab a little bit of the gold, guys. So although we did grab that second star, I think it is... I think it's fair to say this strategy really isn't the greatest just yet. Maybe my dragons aren't high level enough. Maybe the strategy itself just doesn't work, guys. But I think we're going to chuck this one in the bin. So I still need your help, my subscribers. What is the strategy we should use inside of the next episode?